The miller's son went to the best shoemaker in the town. Сын мельника пошел к лучшему сапожнику в городе. The miller's son went to the best shoemaker in the town. The shoemaker made elegant shoes and boots for gentlemen. Сапожник делал элегантные туфли и сапоги для джентльменов. The shoemaker made elegant shoes and boots for gentlemen. I want to order a fine pair of very small boots. Я хочу заказать отличную пару очень маленьких сапожек. I want to order a fine pair of very small boots. They are for my cat, said the young man. Они для моего кота, сказал молодой человек. They are for my cat, said the young man. Okay, said the shoemaker. Хорошо, сказал сапожник. Okay, said the shoemaker. He was not surprised at all. Он совсем не удивился. He was not surprised at all. Or perhaps just a little. Или может быть совсем чуть-чуть. Or perhaps just a little. Do you have any money? He asked. У тебя есть деньги? Спросил он. Do you have any money? He asked. Here you are, said the miller's son. Вот, держите, сказал сын мельника. Here you are, said the miller's son. He took his last silver coin out of his pocket and gave it to the shoemaker. Он вынул из кармана последнюю серебряную монету и отдал ее сапожнику. He took his last silver coin out of his pocket and gave it to the shoemaker. Soon the boots were made. Вскоре сапоги были сделаны. Soon the boots were made. The cat pulled them on. Кот надел их. The cat pulled them on. He looked very nice in his elegant boots. Он выглядел очень хорошо в своих элегантных сапогах. He looked very nice in his elegant boots. Don't worry about the money, master. Не беспокойтесь о деньгах, хозяин. Don't worry about money, master. I'm going to bring you luck, said the cat in boots. Я принесу вам удачу, сказал кот в сапогах. I'm going to bring you luck, said the cat in boots.
He put the bag around his neck. Он повесил сумку себе на шею. He put the bag around his neck. Cats have no hands, so he held the strings in his four paws. У котов нет рук, поэтому он держал веревки в передних лапах. Cats have no hands, so he held the strings in his four paws. Then he put some vegetables and a piece of bread into the bag. Потом он положил немного овощей и кусок хлеба в сумку. Then he put some vegetables and a piece of bread into the bag. The cat went to the woods. Кот пошел в лес. The cat went to the woods. There were many rabbits there. Там было много кроликов. They were many rabbits there. So he lay down pretending to be dead. Поэтому он лег, притворившись мертвым. So he lay down pretending to be dead. The cat didn't move at all. Кот не двигался совсем. The cat didn't move at all. His plan was to wait for some foolish rabbit to come and look into his bag. Его план состоял в том, чтобы дождаться, пока какой-нибудь глупый кролик придет и заглянет в его сумку. His plan was to wait for some foolish rabbit to come and look into his bag. The cat didn't wait alone. Кот не ждал долго. The cat didn't wait long. Soon a foolish young rabbit put his head inside the bag. Вскоре глупый молодой кролик сунул голову в сумку. Soon a foolish young rabbit put his head inside the bag. The cat closed the strings at once and caught him. Кот сразу же затянул веревки и поймал его. Здесь недословно. Слово closed, закрыл, оно не совсем подходит по смыслу. Имеется в виду, что он закрыл, затянув. The cat closed the strings at once and caught him. Then very proud, he went with a back to the palace and asked to speak with the king. Затем очень гордый, он отправился с сумкой во дворец и попросил разрешения поговорить с королем. Then, very proud, he went with the bag to the palace and asked to speak with the king. The king agreed to see the unusual visitor. Король согласился принять необычного гостя. The king agreed to see the unusual visitor. 
The cat went upstairs to the king's room. Кот поднялся наверх в королевскую комнату. The cat went upstairs to the king's room. He came up to the king and made a low bow. Он подошел к королю и низко поклонился. He came up to the king and made a low bow. Then he said. Потом он сказал. Then he said. Sir, here is a nice rabbit from the lands which belong to my noble master, the Marquis of Carabas. Сэр, вот хороший кролик из земель, принадлежащих моему благородному господину, маркизу Карабасу. Сэр, here is a nice rabbit from the lands which belong to my noble master, the Marquis of Carabas. He decided to give his young master this title. Он решил дать своему молодому господину этот титул. He decided to give his young master this title. He told me to offer it to your majesty. Он велел мне предложить его вашему величеству. He told me to offer it to your majesty. Tell your master, said the king politely, that I thank him for his nice present. Передай своему господину, вежливо сказал король, что я благодарю его за этот хороший подарок. Tell your master, said the king politely, that I thank him for his nice present. I am very pleased with his attention. Я очень доволен его вниманием. I am very pleased with his attention. Another time, the cat went to a wheat field and hit a man standing wheat. В другой раз кот пошел на пшеничное поле и спрятался среди стоящей пшеницы. Another time, the cat went to a wheat field and hit a man standing wheat. He again held his back open. Он снова раскрыл свою сумку. He again held his back open. Soon two fat partridges ran into the bag. Вскоре в сумку забежали две жирные куропатки. Soon two fat partridges ran into the bag. The cat drew the strings and caught them both. Кот потянул за веревочки и поймал их обоих. The cat drew the strings and caught them both. The cat went to the king's palace again. Кот снова отправился в королевский дворец. The cat 
went to the king's palace again. He gave the patriages to the king with the same message from his master as before. Он отдал куропаток королю с тем же посланием от своего хозяина, что и прежде. He gave the patriages to the king with the same message from his master as before. The king received the gift. Король принял подарок. The king received the gift. His majesty was very pleased. Его величество был очень доволен. His majesty was very pleased. He even ordered to take the cat down into the kitchen and give him something to eat and drink. Он даже приказал отвезти кота на кухню и дать ему поесть и попить. He even ordered to take the cat down into the kitchen and give him something to eat and drink. The cat enjoyed the meal very much. Коту еда очень понравилась. Здесь недословно enjoy – наслаждаться, enjoyed – наслаждался. The cat enjoyed the meal very much. He sat in the kitchen for a long time talking about his rich master, the Marquis of Carabas. Он долго сидел на кухне и рассказывал о своем богатом хозяине, маркизе Карабасе. He sat in the kitchen for a long time, talking about his rich master, the Marquis of Carabas.